Yo, what up, y'all? It's Sana Ace Harris here, and I'm DJ Tag, and we're here to talk to you about how we produce my Chef Montano's Slow Wine featuring Afro B. Super excited to kind of rep our culture, rep Liberia, and kind of pay homage to our heritage and put a whole like twist and new like new age Afro B sound to it. So, yeah, check it out. So this is how the record starts. Um, it kind of has this like slow uh, pitch down. I think it's like seven or eight semitones, and it's half speed, and this is kind of the intro to the record. That part of the record came from a part of the sample from the original song by Big Steve. That's like at the end of the song. So I'll play a little bit of that so you can kind of hear. When the song dropped, they was like, yo, where the sample came from and everything. But that's pretty much it pitched down. And then I'll show you another part of the beat that we sampled. This part right here was kind of inserted all through the beat. So that part came from this part of the sample. Again, it's pitched down crazy, really slowed down, which I think is kind of gives it that like vintage vibe. Again, those are the two parts we sample, but the, the, the base of the song was really, um, I would say, when Tag added, talk about like, some of the keys you added, I guess this part right here. The chords I used were basically the chord structure you hear in the original song, but I always like to add my own flavor, my own sauce, you know, a little bit of my playing style. We slowed the song down and we took that sound and just layered that with the same chord progression, but with a lighter texture in the keys. So what I did was a lot of that extra sauce is just my style I wanted to add to the beat. So the bass line is like a tonal snare a pitch all the way down you can't find it like on a vst anything so i would give you that patch but you gotta you know you gotta pay that exclusive price <laughs> you know what i'm saying <laughs> that's good but money now. also another sound that the synth stabs that we had we um pitched them down like 12 db and kind of added some filter on it so it can have a little bit of vibe and polish sound kind of like this Again, that just gives it that world sound that we're, we're going for where you can hear it anywhere. This was like a, the synth stab was yeah. like the main, kind of like the main, I guess, melodic rhythm. Like that rhythm, I just kind of picture you in like world, yeah. vibey, summertime. Yeah. Major so, laser, major, you know, those type of things. Picture uh, you in that, Afro beat. Kind of picture in that mood. Yeah. I think the next sound we added was a flute thing called a turnaround sound because it kind of just, Keeps the ear interested, keeps you engaged, and kind of lets the loop not be too boring. So it's like a little quick flute thing that we added, you'll hear. So it was going every time. So you'll hear the, the synth pads going. And then like every, I think four bars, you'll hear. Drum pattern was pretty, you know, uh, I mean, not, not a complicated pattern. But I think we, we spent like a lot of time fighting over the textures, which is yeah. kind of like, kind of like something we try to do, but. Um, here was the pattern right here. One thing I want to highlight is obviously you have the kick and snare going, which is pretty dope, but it has this like, so this is the kind of kick and rim shot. That's kind of like, I think what gives it that unique feel is that there's like a snare, like a, like a high pitch snare that's going every other um, like uh, couple bars, which kind of makes that pattern stand out a little bit. So it's like. We originally had these drum rolls. 
and at the last minute it was bugging me i was like yo this sounds <laughs> <laughs> it was like yo it sounds it sounds cool but almost leans too much on edm you just needed something to put on top of it yeah so we added like some like afro beat drum rolls to kind of give it some more texture and polish and it kind of came out like this <laughs> So it's like you got like the 808 EDM type drum rolls with the mm -hmm. Afro beat rhythm. So that combo was just made up for a dope, a dope um, combination. Put everything together, um, focal sample, the synth stabs, the piano, the drums, bass, and it kind of everything glues together. Sounds kind of. Mm -hmm. 